It's time for Tech Time with Timmy. Hello, welcome to Tech Time with Timmy. In this episode, Timmy's going to be talking about how to schedule emails in Mail Merge for Gmail. So in Mail Merge, which is a cool thing Timmy's talked about multiple times before, that you have on, on, on Google Sheets and then it sends emails through Gmail, and it's really cool, you can actually, normally when you do it, it just sends them as soon as you click it. But what if you wanted it to go at a certain time and you didn't want to be there to click it at that certain time? Well, you can actually schedule it so it will go out whenever you ask instead of the time you click the button, which is really helpful if you want it to go out at different times. And you can even schedule it for different ones, so you might want these four to go at this time and then the next to go at this time and you can change it around and schedule it to all different times. So it's really cool and in this episode Timmy's going to show you how to do that. Okay, so once you've got Mail Merge all set up and ready to go and you've got your draft email open in Gmail and everything like that. If you don't know how to do that, you can watch a previous episode where Timmy shows you how to set up Mail Merge and everything. So once you've got Mail Merge all set up, You'll notice on the Mail Merge template here, the very last column says Schedule Date. So you, you can put a date in there. So you can also put a time in there. So you can you type the date, then put a space, and then just type something like 11 a.m. And then it works that out. So you, you can you can do that and you can do you can choose to not have a date for that one and it'll just go instantly and then the next one you might want to do a different date and a different time and so you can you can fill out as many of those as you want depending on how many email addresses you're sending to so then once you've put in any dates you want to have in then you can just go and do the normal process for m running Mail Merge. So you click Add-ons, and then go down to Mail Merge with Attachments, come across this menu, and come down to Configure Mail Merge, and just click on that. And then you can change any of this that you want to, and then you just click Continue. And you, you need to select the draft. So you do all that like you normally would in Mail Merge, and then you just click Run ma Mail Merge. And it says Mail Merge is now running. So right now it's sending the ones that you didn't put a date in, if there are any ones you didn't put a date in. And then, so that's done. So you can just click Done, and then you can close this if you want, because you, you'll notice here it says these two are scheduled. So you can just leave them scheduled like that, until and then they'll end up sending so you can close this and now you don't have to do anything the email will just send so that's really cool and that's how it's done that'll be the end of this episode of tech time with timmy bye